Caitlin Clark joins weekend update desk during surprise Saturday Night Live appearance. Women's basketball superstar Caitlin Clark made a surprise appearance on this week's Saturday Night Live during the show's weekend update segment. Clark, who will likely be the top pick in Monday's WNBA draft that is being held in New York, popped by Studio 8H and joined the weekend update desk with anchors Michael Che and Colin Jost. The NCAA's all-time leading scorer showed up after Che made a joke about Iowa retiring Clark's jersey. Che then read some more jokes that Clark wrote. After the humorous exchange, Clark delivered a heartfelt message about her basketball future after Che wished her success in her upcoming rookie season in the WNBA. I'm sure it will be a big first step for me, but it's just one step for the WNBA thanks to all the great players like Cheryl Swoops, Lisa Leslie, Cynthia Cooper, the great Don Staley, and my basketball hero, Maya Amor. These are the women that kicked down the door so I could walk inside. So, I want to thank them tonight for laying the foundation, Clark said. Clark returned to the stage for the goodbyes given by host Ryan Gosling. But she wasn't alone, Iowa teammates Jada Gamphy, Gabby Marshall, and Kate Martin also joined her. Clark will soon be playing for the WNBA's Indiana Fever, which is basically a lock to select her number one. Her record-setting college career recently came to an end as Iowa fell in the national championship game for a second consecutive season. Caitlin Clark on SNL, watch her weekend update appearance. Michael Che was humbled by basketball star Caitlin Clark when she crashed Saturday Night Live's weekend update segment after the comedian made a sexist joke at her expense. The University of Iowa announced that basketball star Caitlin Clark will have her jersey retired and replaced with an apron, Che said. Che then introduced the reel. Caitlin Clark and other women athletes have given hope to girls across the country that women's sports can be just as important as men's. Discover 2024's hidden gem that is trading $20 per coin. Unravel the secrets right here. Slash screen grab Saturday Night Live's Michael Che has a history of using jokes to diminish women's sports, and this week was no different. During Saturday's weekend update, Che shared that the University of Iowa announced that basketball star Caitlin Clark will have her jersey retired and replaced with an apron. The joke elicited plenty of groans followed by some huge laughs when Clark herself joined Che and Colin Jost at their desk just a few seconds later. Clark wasn't quite buying it when Che. Editorial, Caitlin Clark won more than just basketball games as an Iowa Hawkeye. The Barbie star hosted the show on April 13 alongside musical guest Chris Stapleton. Ryan Gosling attempted to break up with Ken during the Saturday Night Live monologue, but the Kinergy was too strong. I'm here because of my new movie, The Fall Guy with Emily Blunt, Gosling said at the beginning of his monologue. So don't worry. I'm not going to make any jokes about Ken because it's. Caitlin Clark made an appearance on Weekend Update during this week's Saturday Night Live and it was a slam dunk. The Iowa basketball star, who set an NCAA scoring record this year and is projected to be the number one WNBA draft pick on Monday, joined Michael Che and Colin Joss to discuss sports. The WNBA's best will be ready and waiting for the likely number one overall selection. And by the time Clark's rookie season is done, she will have played almost non-stop for a calendar year. Prince William and Princess Kate have shared a joint statement following the tragic stabbings at a shopping center in Sydney. See full statement. Siwa's new single Karma, which she released on Friday April 5, is her first foray in what she says is gay pop. US President Joe Biden on Friday said he expected Iran to attack Israel sooner, rather than later and warned Tehran not to proceed. Asked by reporters about his message to Iran, Biden said simply, don't, and he underscored Washington's commitment to defend Israel. Italian Prime Minister Giorgia Meloni says surrogacy is inhuman and is backing steeper penalties against the practice, including fines exceeding $1 million and multiple year prison sentences. The Italian designer's death was announced by his company on Friday. Detroit Pistons, 14-67, 15th in the Eastern Conference, vs. San Antonio Spurs, 
14th in the Western Conference, San Antonio, Sunday 3.30 p.m. At bottom line, the Detroit Pistons take on the San Antonio Spurs in a non-conference matchup. The Spurs have gone 11-29 at home. San Antonio has a 5-7 record in games decided by three points or fewer. The Pistons are 7-34 on the road. Detroit ranks 8th in the Eastern Conference with 14.3 fast break points per game led by Jaden Ivey averaging 3.1. The SP. The main aim of stock picking is to find the market beating stocks. But the main game is to find enough winners to more. She's ready for Miami. The trio were spotted together in Florida during the Royal Salute Polo Challenge at the Grand Champions Polo Club. Murmurin SEI's Gozalajini Ilamek Isan Edi Yak Tudugunas Guk, Kalait Be Saglam Lik Arctic Daha Yakaninis Da, Izmir Mirmur Fweri NDA. MLB Clubhouse attendants don't have the most glamorous job, but players will tell you they couldn't do their job without the clubbies. <laughs>